The special response team has cleared the building. The gunman is not inside direct insurance. We have uh, gotten a very detailed statement from the manager who was inside the business at the time. The police department's now efforting to locate and make contact with the person who the manager believes was inside the business with the gun. Again, when the individual uh, came in, he did not see the manager. The manager was able to see the guy approaching. Uh, he actually hid. Once the guy came into the business, the manager was able to run out the door. Uh, the manager did see the man's stature, uh, did hear him speak a few words. So we're now uh, working with the manager of direct insurance to positively identify this individual and go from there. But he was not inside the business when the special response team went inside and cleared it. Was his vehicle in the parking lot? Uh, the vehicle description that I have heard is not there. Do we believe he's still armed? Well, uh, based on what the manager said of a person with a long gun entering the business, yes. Based on uh, his report to us, yes, there's no gun inside the building. What's the status of the other businesses? Are they going to be reopened? Everything is, everything is reopening. The uh, strip center has been cleared. Uh, we're still focusing on direct insurance. There'll be some evidence processing, uh, fingerprinting, if you will, done in all likelihood, uh, and we'll, uh, we'll go from there. Is there a bolo out for the guy right now that you can put out for us? Or? No. Uh, we want to uh, uh, confirm the identity of the person who went inside, and once that confirmation is done, we'll go from there. But according to the manager from Direct Insurance, he believes this person to have been uh, one with whom they have had difficulties in the past. A client of, of Direct? Uh, I believe so, yes.